Hi everyone, Shubhu here. Hope you are doing well. So welcome to my channel, Tech Interview Guider. So in this video, today we'll be talking about interview experience of Comviva. So please stay tuned on this video. Comviva is basically a telecommunication based company who have their headquarter in Gurgaon, and also they have their office in Bangalore, Mumbai. And Comviva's parent organization is Tech Mahindra. Thank you, Devasis, for first of all coming. Okay, Devasis recently got an offer from Comviva. So Devasis, could you pre give you a brief introduction? Yes, yeah, sure. Uh, hi guys, uh, I am Devasis Kumar Sahu. Currently, I am pursuing my B.Tech in CSC at uh, College of Engineering Technology, Bhubaneswar, and uh, I am also an intern at Comviva. I am from Bhubaneswar, Odisha. So that's all about me. That's great. So Devasis, can you tell me what are the interview rounds in Comviva? Yes, sir. Uh, so uh, there are uh, generally four rounds. Uh, first round being the online test, uh, and that was conducted on AMCAD platform for us, uh, which consists of two coding questions and around 20 MCQs. And two coding questions were based on uh, medium to easy, easy to medium level, based on uh, DSA, normal DSA, and the MCQs were based on aptitude and also CS fundamentals like uh, OOPS concept, operating system, DBMS, etc. And after that, uh, the next round was the technical interview, uh, which was mainly focused on OOPS concept and uh, few coding questions also. Uh, uh, in my uh, technical interview, he asked me a question on sorting algorithm. And apart from that, a lot of questions on OOPS concepts and a brief, uh, discuss, um, brief discussion on the project that I have done and also uh, previous internships discussions. So that was all about the technical interview. Uh, okay. After the technical interview, uh, after a few days, I got a mail that I have cleared the technical interview and I had to submit a write-up on a topic that was given to me. <clears throat> they had given me a topic and I had to write about 100 to 150 words on paper and so I had to submit to it, uh, submit that to them in the email itself. Uh, so I would suggest that uh, please don't copy that uh, topic from internet. That would be great. I mean, if you could write by it by your own, your own, then it would be good for you and for the future also. Uh, so after that, uh, after a few days, I got a mail regarding that uh, my HR interview will be conducted, uh, which was the last round. And the HR interview was, uh, um, uh, was last round. It was mainly based on the resumes that I had. I mean, he asked questions from my resume and some of the few leadership principles. And towards the end, uh, he uh, told me that uh, I don't have anything to ask you. Uh, so now you can just impress me. I try to do tell something so that I can be impressed. He told me that. So that was one of the good things that I experienced. I told him something that he may have got exp uh, impressed. So he, uh, finally, I got off a letter and a welcome email from Comviva. And now I am an intern at Comviva. Great. Like their interview process, I guess, mostly based on like problem solving and like DSL problem solving and like some, some question based on OOPS concept and computer funding. Yeah, that, that is mostly based on uh, DSL problem solving, OOPS concept and uh, computer fundamentals only. Okay. And can you tell me what are the OOPS questions they have asked? Like one, two question. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Uh, I don't remember the course, all the questions. So one of the <laughs> questions that I remember is uh, uh, he told me to define inheritance. Like I, I defined the inheritance. He told me uh, tell what are the types of inheritance. Okay. I told them different types of inheritance. And uh, at last he told me uh, like write a code to uh, show some examples of different inheritance. So uh, in OOPS concept also, they asked me to write code in inheritance and also uh, some different other OOPS concept also, he asked me to write code. So uh, it would be better if you could write code in all OOPS concepts. <clears throat> and like in the first online assessment round, there are some problem solving question, I guess. Two problem solving questions. Yeah, there are two coding questions and I don't continue. Like what is the different oh, what are what are the questions like based on linear DSL or non-linear DSL? Go? Yeah, they, I mean uh, they can be anything. For me, that was one question was based on linked list and another was based on trees. I think so. I mean you cannot expect. Uh, like one from I cannot say that it is another from non-linear. Yeah, uh, so it is better to prepare from everything. 
Okay, yeah, absolutely. Great, great. Any tips for those students who have their upcoming interview in Comviva? Can you tell us? Yes, sure. Uh, for those who are going to give an interview, I would suggest them, first of all, uh, do some aptitudes. I mean, uh, that's the basic thing uh, in the online test. They may ask in the HR on also some aptitudes or puzzles. So after that, uh, CS fundamentals are important. Uh, I think you all have done that uh, if you are preparing for Comiva from four years of engineering, you may have done that. And apart from that, coding, I mean, basic DSL go, that's also important. And the most important thing is the OOPS concept. So I think all these things you can prepare. And apart from that, your leadership skills and your speaking skills, that will also help you getting a good position. Okay. Also, like, is the ask question on like uh, system design, low level design or high level design? No, uh, no. actually, as we are students, we don't have, I mean, we don't start the system design. So yes. we're not asking questions on system design. Okay. Okay. Like mostly it's like a problem solving and like OOPS concept and like computer fundamentals. PSL, yeah. Okay. Great. Yeah. So can you tell us what are the tick stacks in Comviva? Yes, sure. Uh, uh, as per my knowledge, uh, they work on Android and that is Kotlin and Java full stack and I was uh, using Swift and many other things also. So I mean, I don't know all the things that they work on. Uh, as per my knowledge, these things that they work on. And I am also currently uh, in the team of iOS and learning Swift and working on iOS development. So that's all. Okay, like different type of tech stacks are available in Comviva. Yeah, yeah, different, definitely. That's great. So thank you again for coming. Okay, and like for more this kind of content, please like, share, subscribe and subscribe our channel. Thank you. Yeah, thank you guys. Bye.